Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I, I really want Put it this way Nothing is going according to plans with this van Hi, welcome back to another Van Bill series. So far, I've stripped out the van completely. So that means it's time for a deep clean and preparations for window installation. Yes, I said it. It's time to get them in. I'm going to give it like an hour or two, let that dry properly. Then I'm going to come back and cure the rust. It's just tiny little holes from the screws that was in the flooring. And then uh, I'm going to actually save these bits of wood that I took out the, the door. They're in great condition. I can probably use it for a backing of something. Right, I'm back after a couple hours and the van is basically dry now. So I can go and cure the little rusty holes with this thing here. This is just the fuck. Ha <laughs> ha, you dickhead. Don't a bird. Right. <laughs> I picked this up and this was right beside <laughs> the rust primer. It says <laughs> Rustin's brush restore for hard brushes. <laughs> it's the wrong fucking thing. And I'm here eating my dinner as fast as I could run up back here to use the last light that I have to cure the rust and it's not even the right thing. What the hell am I doing? I have the right rust primer anyways and I do have a few holes to do with this one that's not rusted so I'll just go ahead and do that. Next one I'll be in here is next week sometime and that's when I'm going to try prepping for the windows and at least try and install what I have and lock the van up and call it an evening it's cold. Right. This is another day. Yeah, I'm just going to see if I can make the templates with the cardboard boxes the windows actually came in and then I'll go from there. That's the plan for this series anyways. this bad boy oh no it's falling this isn't mine one of the jerseys but it's broken oh, oh. James family his dad started a, a fundraiser basically the Waterford hospice that James uh, stayed up for a very long time. Oh, it was great. So this probably came all the way from Australia. It looked like it was bubble wrap really well, but not ticking off. That's sad. So I'm just going to pull it to the side and I'll steal the cardboard. Right, back to the van to get another box. These are the other two boxes that I have. This one and this one. So hopefully these are the actual windows. Just give me a break for breed. Okay, let's open it. This is a lot of cardboard and I'm happy about it because it's a perfect uh, usage for templates. Okay, this is actually the sliding door window, but I can see another one in there. The other one is actually the rear side window. So I got five windows in total. I think I got a window for the sliding door here that can open. I have one small camper van window, you know, the tiny overlooking ones that opens. That's going to go on the passenger side over here. 
I got two rear end, so the back rear doors, two windows for there, and then I have a window for this side. That doesn't open, it's just for views and stuff. Right. Okay. That's big. Well, it did say it was for a Renault Master, so. So I placed the window flat on here, and I'm just going to trace around the entire window. And then I'm going to get the measuring tape and measure this all the way around, and then make that. morning it's another day I woke up this morning and I said fuck it I'm just gonna go for it I've been putting off putting these windows in for a very long time if I'm gonna fuck it up I'll fuck it up at the end of the day so today's the day it's a really nice day out I'm going to take full advantage of it <sighs> let's do this so these are the tools we're going to be using today we have drill angle grinder sorry angle grinder jigsaw suction pads blades, drill bits, adhesive. I have one that's already open. I was just checking if it actually came out properly. I did a test there earlier and it worked really well. I have my glove, goggles, tape, primer and all that stuff. The only thing I need to go grab real quick is a cleaning solution and a plastic sheet. I'm on a roll. It's hot, yo. Absolutely shitting myself. I haven't even started yet and I just drill bit my piece of skin off. Ugh! This isn't traumatizing, I don't know what is. There's a window. Oil. And it's been botched. Oh, I had this to protect my neck. It is hot, man. <sighs> the amount of metals I have in my boobies is ridiculous. And so that's my first hole in the van and I'm not even going to lie. It probably took me two or three minutes to try and do that. Yet another blade. Dang it. Constantly sick. Good morning. So today is the 12th of June. Um, things haven't been moving as quickly as I'd wish it to move. I'm using my monthly wages. I get paid and that's the money I use to buy the little supplies I need for the van. So that's a big reason why the van hasn't been continuing. Building on the van came to a complete stop because I've been in a really bad way yes I do feel sorry for myself sometimes but there's days where I just can't move just can't shift the feeling it actually <laughs> looks like a camper which I'm really happy about so I'm just gonna enjoy my coffee listen to the birds feel the sun on my face stick around <laughs> bye